It's quite difficult to have an interview about paintings because the act of painting is done in silence. And we use painting instead of using words. I started to paint around 30, 32, so actually it's almost 40 years. I was concentrating only in uh, the conflict between black and white, which was for me and still is the parallel between darkness and light. And uh, the last four years I decided to follow uh, the Japanese tradition in which uh, the gold symbolized the light and um, did a series of paintings uh, connected to nature. Naturally, as a painter, I'm not imitating what I see. The tree and the trunk is just the starting point in which, in a figurative way, I start the painting. But more and more as I proceed in the act of painting, I try to compare it to a body, to a human figure or to other associations that leads me from the objective form of a tree to a more abstract approach. to be part of nature and not somebody who looks at nature, I developed a certain way of convincing myself that instead of saying, I look at the tree, a sentence that puts me in the center, I am looking at the tree. I try to be more humble and to say the tree is seen by me. And by saying that, I emphasize that the tree is there as a tree. And he can be observed by me, by a bird, by the wind, by the clouds, because he is part of nature. Well, a day in the studio starts with uh, a series of drawings. I um, don't believe that I can or that I'm able to start with the canvas itself. I need uh, a starting point. I use brush, not a pencil. All my drawings are brush drawings. Uh, usually I paint on small formats. But then sometimes I develop it to larger scale of paper to big formats. And uh, here is the result of those, uh, this process. These were all made in a certain day. It's the beginning of a day, actually. My attitude towards light was that I'm not going to be dependent by a source of light, by a natural source, which means uh, the sun or the moon or, or a candle or a fire flame. 
And the light would be more subjective and will come from the inner side of the paintings and will emphasize the mystical atmosphere that I'm looking for. The remains of light. I mean, what does someone see when there is almost no light? I mean, from the darkness comes the light.